So after coming back, ladies and gentlemen, uh, for only uh, just several hours ago, um, and after recording my round six of MLP Hunger Games, and even though we're not all done, Wire Heartstrings has won her division and becoming District 8 leader, followed by Trixie, and considered they both killed each other, but they kind of did work together and kind of healed each other. Well, Lyra did to Trixie, and but they managed to finish themselves through and make it to the finals, which was actually a good thing, considering it would have been easy, but yet again... <laughs> It was a good performance for both of them, so congratulations. And considering Trixie has out seven kills, technically we don't have to worry about that because she already made it to the finals because of how many points she had. She had seven points uh, total into that six round she did, finishing third place. And that upped her up big time from making it to the finals. So you gotta give her credit for scoring those points. And to be honest, so technically she's already in the finals for the heck of it. Now for Rainbow Dash, and um, well, mostly if you wanna talk about Big Mac and Surprise and well, mostly Oculus and well, to be honest, I think it's there's nothing much we could say about it. And also um, to keep this in mind guys, um, competition of the most points we had here and the points basis of some of the players that are still competing in the third place chance round is pretty interesting for uh, what's going on. Some players that did got points kind of finished in horrible positions. Now, we already showed you round one, round two, round three, round four. This was round five. Now we go to round six. So technically, guys, by three points for Big Mac and Rainbow Dash and four points here, they get the chance to make it to round eight for a third place chance. Uh, Gallus, considering he did score out points in the round of competition, but yet again, there wasn't much about it because technically, even though in his last game, if it kind of made sense because he had zero points in round four due to the uh, MLP characters of non-pony characters and Phillies and Colts. So, um... Considering that he only scored two points is not enough to up the ante. He upped the ante to fifth and fourth place, but they got more points than he did, so he's eliminated. Banana Fluff, defending champion, uh, Sweetie Bell is out of the playoffs. So, um, yeah, it's a pretty tough time to witness that, but it is what it is for competition. Uh, all we can say is it's going to be really interesting to know uh, the fact. Um, Dr. Hooves and Bree Burn, considering they did score out points, they did, but still not even enough to up bigger points here. So, yeah, Elimination was already there. And to be honest, guys, if Rainbow Dash, guys, even if Trixie actually finished, like, let's just say she finished ninth place or something like that, she would have up the end. Or even if she finished eighth place with seven kills total. And even if she scored a few kills early in the first of the Unicorns division... She would have upped it way past first place a little bit. But yeah, again, with Rainbow Dash coming here to four points due to that, it would have been a real tiebreaker for who would have gotten the most points, considering that Rainbow Dash did score points in the last match, but yet again. So yeah, um, it's going to be interesting to know what's going to happen in round seven, because in the next round, considering these three are also going to be in the second chance round, Followed by these three that are going to be in the third place chance round. And just like these three as well. And uh, these three are going to give one more chance. Because they have one more chance for each other for second chance. These three as well. And some of these MLP characters that are in round 7 are going to have a second chance. And probably having a third chance to make it. And consider with Sky, Sky Stinger getting 4 points and starting out with 7th place in the rounds. He needs all the luck he can get. And um... As for the seventh round picks of these players, we're going to have to say who's going to get lucked on because, yet again, they need all the luck they can get if they want to make it. And that goes for round seven, too, because these players, consider they messed up so bad, and just like these players as well, all I can say is this is going to be a really really tough competition for what's going to happen in round seven. But for now, guys, that's going to be all for the information today. Uh, as of right now, after eight district slots, these are the top eight from all districts. We only have two more slots for each, so we'll be right back next time. Voxel out.